Good morning. Actually, it's afternoon. It's almost five o'clock now. I have been editing videos all day. I edited the vlog for today. The Epcot video from yesterday I had to finish editing because that was very, it was like an hour and a half worth of footage. So it was very crazy. Um, so I'm finally done. I'm up from the computer. I am actually going to, I know I look kind of crazy. I'm going to do a face mask because um, my skin is like freaking out right now. I don't know if it's because of like the humidity or what? I don't know. I want to blame it on something. I'm pretty sure it's because of all the terrible food we've been eating, the pizza and stuff. So if that's one reason to eat healthy, for me especially, it's to keep my skin clear because I found that the things that I eat really, really affect my skin. And I don't like that because I don't want to have terrible skin. Well, I don't like it. <laughs> so uh, long story short, I'm going to do a face mask. I don't know which face mask I'm going to do. I have a glycolic peel that I might try. I also have my Glam Glow. I have one mask left in my Glam Glow and I might use that. I might try to switch it up. Sometimes I'll do like a an anti-aging mask up here because I have a really deep set wrinkle on my forehead. I'm constantly like self-conscious about, which is why I normally have bangs because I like to cover it. But, uh, but yeah, so maybe I'll do like a anti-aging and then like a, cl a clearing on the bottom because that's where all of my like hormonal things happen, which isn't fun. So yeah, for face masks. So now that I've talked to you about face masks for two whole minutes, here's the money. Here's all the boxes that we need to um, recycle. <laughs> like the recycle guys won't take them because they don't fit like laying down in the recycle bin and I really wish they would take them, but they won't. So we gotta figure that out. Where's the bean? I see the bean butt. Is the bean under here? Are you under here, bean? You are, what are you doing? Is it because it's the thundering a little bit? Yeah. It started to thunder a little bit. So this guy was just not having it. He's uh, just been hanging out with me all day editing. We've been having a really good day, so. Yay, yay for good days. Okay, I put my face mask on. I used the Glam Glow Youth Mud uh, Tingle Exfoliant. It's very, very tingly, it burns. And actually, every time I use it, I cry. Like, it makes me cry. So, just be aware of that, that it's very, very harsh and it will hurt your eyeballs. <laughs> so, this is it, it's drying. It does have little pieces. Um, I also didn't have enough to cover my whole face, obviously. So, I'm very sad about that but uh, it has little pieces of tea in it, which is like the stuff you see on my face. So I find that it really works though. So I just wanted to show you guys how crazy it looks. But yeah, but it really hurts my eyes. Like no joke, I cried. <laughs> so I almost forgot to say, I'm sorry, I know I've been looking at the screen the whole time. I just wanna make sure I'm in focus. So that's why I was looking at, oh, see, that's why, that's why. There you go. That's why I was looking at not you, but at you up here. Um, I'm gonna look up here just to make sure that I don't go super blurry again, but I'm talking to you in there. But so I, uh, the other day when I was not wearing any makeup, like at this very moment, I somebody asked what was wrong with my eyebrows and um, it doesn't like hurt my feelings or anything, but I feel like I should probably explain because sometimes I have eyebrows and sometimes I don't. And I know that that's probably strange for some of you. And maybe that's the change that you're not used to. And maybe it's a surprise that you're like, whoa, Jen, what happened to your eyebrows? <laughs> so I totally get it. Um, my hair is very, very blonde. It's super light. Um, I don't know if you can see. It's kind of hard to tell, but um, I don't know if I'm in focus because I can't see, but the top of my hair, you can see where the purple ends and you can see where my hair is. My hair is naturally very, very blonde and so my eyebrows are very, very blonde as well and so if I don't draw them in, this is what they look like. They look like little, tiny, sad eyebrows that aren't there. So that's that's what happened to Jen's eyebrows. But, but yeah, so that's why I draw them in. And actually, speaking of eyebrows, I'm thinking of trying like one of the more like popular eyebrow things, like the Anastasia, I don't know how to say it, but that brand, um, I don't know, what do you guys think? Do any of you guys use that? Do you think it works? Do you have something that works better? Let me know, I'm super, super interested. So that is the story of the face mask and the eyebrows, the end. Oh my gosh, you guys, I was letting the dogs out to go to the bathroom after dinner and I saw the scary bug. I have never seen a bug do this. Sorry, I don't know how to zoom in on this camera. Okay, it's that. That's the bug. I know it's really hard to... Oh, there, do you see it swimming? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I've never seen a bug do that. Oh, did I miss it? The whole thing? It was that. 
What is that? Oh my god. What is that? Oh, oh my god, there's things in the pool that look like bugs that can swim like a fish. I'm never getting in this pool again. What in the heck? I don't even know where it is now. I'm like scared for my life. Have you guys ever seen a bug do that? It's a bug. Ugh. Okay, so that's the bug right there. And I just want to get it swimming because it looks like a fish. It's so crazy. It swims really fast. Let me see if I can get it. But, okay, I'm just waiting for it to swim now. Oh, 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 did you see that? Did you see that? Did you see that? <gasps> what is this? It's a bug. That's it. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, it's it right there. That's it right there. What is this? What is that, guys? Oh my god. Oh my god. It's really creeping me out. Oh god. Oh. Oh, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, okay. So I called Tim to see if he knew what the bug was. He's on his way home now. I'm gonna show him the footage because I don't know where it is in the pool anymore, which is scaring me quite a bit, to be honest with you. So, uh, yeah. So now I'm gonna go make dinner. So for one of the sides for dinner tonight, we're gonna have all these roasted veggies. I'm gonna put these in the oven at 425 for like 30-ish minutes, 30, 40 minutes. I just did a little bit of olive oil, some salt, some pepper, yellow squash, zucchini, carrots, onions, a little grape tomatoes, mushrooms, and yeah, I think that's it. So this is going in the oven now. Happy Thursday, everybody. Here's my dinner for Thursday. That's not very much chicken, but it's delicious. We got all them vegetables. Also, it should be known that sometimes I use Bandit as like a phone rest. Like, here's where I keep my phone is on Bandit. And tonight, in preparation for Halloween Horror Nights, we're watching Jason vs. Freddy. Well, that was a fun, like, very classic horror movie, like very slasher, gory movie. It's, it's not gonna win any Academy Awards, that's for darn sure, but it was entertaining. It does bother me that it's called Freddy vs. Jason. It doesn't flow correctly. It should be Jason vs. Freddy, right? I understand why it's Freddy vs. Jason because of the whole storyline and everything like that, but flows better as Jason vs. Freddy. Every time that I'm gonna talk about the house for Halloween Horror Nights, I'm gonna call it Jason vs. Freddy just because it just it feels better coming out of my mouth. So I just spent a little bit of time on the old Google image search and I found a bunch of uh, like Halloween themed gifts that I can send to people. I don't know, like Ernest from Ernest's Halloween where he's reacting to a scary situation, like, yeah, that's what I got. And then there's another one from the CW where it's the guy from Supernatural and he's opening up a wardrobe and then like a guy dressed as a ghost come out and he goes, boo, that's awesome. Tonight's weird thing that we're gonna try to eat is this Mexican hot chocolate walnuts. I'm a little bit excited for it. All right, first reaction, I'm gonna smell it. Just smells like walnuts, actually. I thought it was gonna smell a lot spicier than this. Hmm, all right, let's give one a try. Kind of intrigued, because like, they they just kind of look like chocolate glazed walnuts of some sort. Let's give it a try. I thought they were gonna be spicy. They're not spicy at all. They just kind of taste like chocolate covered walnuts with a little bit of cinnamon in them. Darn it, well, they're kind of delicious. All right, I'm gonna eat more of them. I'll be honest. I thought these were gonna be spicy. They're not. That's a good thing. They are a little bit cinnamony, but not too cinnamony. I don't know. I'm kind of enjoying them as a matter of fact. That was a fun and exciting time trying out some weird flavored walnuts and watching a horror movie. I'll call it a good night. Also, we ate healthy tonight. So, that's good. Uh, with that being said, I am off to bed. So, I will see you guys tomorrow. And now it's time to pay the price.